with me here, you, you're back to Copenhagen Fashion Week, which yeah. we're so happy to have you here. Thank you. <laughs> oh, <listen. laughs> it's okay. What brings you back to Copenhagen Fashion Week? Um, you know, Copenhagen is one of the uh, city I love. Yeah, that's definitely one of the reasons. But also, this um, when you think about the, the quality of the Fashion Week, the, all the designers that, you know, we can't, we can't leave behind even in the middle of the summer. And also uh, sustainability as well, that's really a key point, you know. Um, and Fashion Week uh, decided to be more sustainable from like last season. It's really uh, exciting news for me because I'm, I'm really working a lot of, on the sustainability recently. So, Why is it so important for you to be here at Copenhagen Fashion Week and be aware of the sustainability changes? What, how do you bring that into your social influence in SoMe? Um, you know, like uh, recently, like wherever I go, even like Southeast Asia, I just came from like Bangkok, uh, you know, everybody's talking about sustainability and, you know, uh, Copenhagen and the city of Copenhagen, also the Copenhagen Fashion Week is really advanced in sustainability. So, lots, lots to learn and lots to, to, uh, to express, lots to, you know, talk to everyone because everybody is really want to know about it. And as far as the clothing goes and the brands, who are you looking forward to seeing? I can't say because it's so many like uh, different type of designer here, from like you know this creative creative one like Cecily Bansen to uh, streetwear like Soland. I had really like exciting news about Soland yesterday, so I'm looking forward to see Soland as well. So yeah, like from street to creative designer, also. Really strong contemporary designer here too, contemporary brands here too. So that's, you know, it's really um, across to, you know, the market, I think. The Thank you so much for coming back, you. you. And enjoy Copenhagen Fashion Week. Thank you so much.